I'm here with David Cantor with CalStart. David, can you tell me a little bit about CalStart? Yeah, CalStart is a nonprofit that's located in Pasadena, California. We are um, a consultancy that's been around for almost 20 years, and what we do is we facilitate the development of advanced transportation technology and alternative fuels. And what does that exactly mean, and, and how does the program uh, affect local municipalities? Well, it's a, it's a really good question. We do a lot of things. We do fleet consulting. Um, we do a lot of project management. We do some research. Um, so it can be a lot of things. But basically what we do is we play, if you look at the commercialization of technology, specifically transportation technology like um, hybrids or fuel cells or, or electric trucks, what we do is we play in that last stage. There's the research, development, demonstration, and commercialization. We really help to move vehicles and, and systems into that commercialization phase. So that may mean bringing the industry together to create a voice of the customer so that they know what they need and they can start making that vehicle. It might mean consulting with them to, to show them what kind of incentives that are necessary for the government to get this, these products moving forward. So you're, you're wor actually really working with manufacturers of, of hybrid vehicles to help them get them off the ground, get them funding, move them forward, correct? Yes, that's correct. It's only partially correct because we work a lot with fleets too. So we, we're, since we're a nonprofit, we're the honest broker in the game. We'll work with government, we'll work with fleets, we'll work with the industry. So we try to be the voice of the customer. We try to, to bring the industry together to move it forward. So we work with manufacturers, but we'll, we'll do it as representatives of fleets. So also, if I'm a business with a, 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 fleet, a fleet of vehicles, then you're someone I would want to talk to. Absolutely. In fact, we've got membership so that some businesses come to us and they say, you know, we don't know what's going on in this sector. Can you give us what's, can you tell us what's going on? Can you give us research, et cetera? So they'll pay for, pay for us to do some consulting for them in that way. Um, also, they may say, look, you know, we, we're a pretty big manufacturer, but we don't, uh, we don't really have enough voice to, to carry this idea. We think this is a great idea. Can you help us get the industry together and we'll talk amongst ourselves and maybe work as one instead of competing against each other to get something that's good for all of us. Where, where do you think the, the, the market or industry needs to move forward and, and, and what are some of the obstacles? Well, that's a great question. I think um, you know a lot of countries have been implementing some type of carbon tax or putting uh, a tax on um, oil and petroleum, etc. That's a, a good way to create kind of uh, the, the stick. Um, in terms of the carrot, the incentives, the state of California is doing a lot. I'd love to see the, the federal government do more uh, to help specifically in the medium-duty and heavy-duty uh, vehicle market.